Hi, I'm Bill Bergstrom with RMA of Southern California. I'm here with Dr. Catherine Green from RMA of Southern California. Dr. Green, I heard IVF makes twins. Is that right? <laughs> Um, IVF can make twins, um, although we strive to um, give each couple a healthy singleton pregnancy. Um, the reason that we try to avoid twins or multiple pregnancies um, is because of the increased risk of pregnancy complications for both uh, the mom and the babies um, if there's more than one um, increased risk for mom and the babies. Um, so we generally recommend transferring just one embryo back into the uterus, though there are situations where um, individual circumstances may warrant um, a consideration, reconsideration of other options. So single embryo transfer is good because it decreases the chance of a twin pregnancy. Um, our group in New Jersey had actually performed a study several years ago that where they looked at patients that had either um, two embryos replaced back into the uterus that were untested embryos versus a single embryo that was transferred back into the uterus that was screened and known to be normal chromosomally. And the pregnancy rates between the two groups were essentially equivalent, although the group that had two embryos replaced had a sig much higher chance of twins. Um, twin pregnancies may do fine, but they do pose increased risk for the mom and the babies in the pregnancy. So in general, we strive to provide each couple with a healthy singleton pregnancy.